What's up everyone? Thank you for trucking with G. I'm Gilbert. Hope you're having a safe and smooth day. I just came across this crazy story right now. Two truck drivers in a shootout driving on I-75. Um, man, let's get into it. According to this news story, WFTV9, Virginia truck driver shoots another truck driver in fit of road rage on I-75. A 43-year-old Virginia truck driver was arrested Wednesday after he shot at another truck driver in a fit of road rage on Interstate 75 near Ocala, the Marion County Sheriff's officer said. Deputies said they were called Sunday to Love's Travel Stop on Northwest 47th Avenue after a truck driver said he was driving a tractor trailer southbound on I-75 when Dylan Nassan Bellistin threw a water bottle at his vehicle. The victim pulled over to confront Bellistin but decided against it and drove away, Sheriff's Office spokesman Zach Moore said in a news release. Bellistin then continued to follow the victim and eventually pulled alongside him again, at which time he fired several shots towards the victim. Moore said the victim then repeatedly decelerated the tractor trailer he was driving to try to avoid being struck by gunfire and returned fire toward Belliston because he feared for his life. Investigators said Belliston also drove to the Love's travel stop, but then drove away and continued southbound on I-75. And here's a picture of what he looks like. Looks like Marion County Sheriff's Office uh, put it on their Facebook page. A Virginia truck driver arrested for road rage shooting. On Wednesday, March 6, 2024, the Marion County Sheriff's Office arrested 43-year-old Dylan Nissan Belliston for shooting a missile into a vehicle, aggravated assault, criminal mischief, and displaying a firearm during a commission of a felony. On Sunday, March 3rd, 2024, Deputy Greer responded to the Love's Travel Stop located at 7791 Northwest 47th Avenue, Ocala, to report of shots fired. The story continues to say, deputies said they obtained information that was used to identify Belliston, and then they also received dash camera footage from his cab. The footage clearly depicted him shooting at the victim at two separate times, Moore said. Belliston also retrieved a second handgun and pointed at the victim without firing. <sighs> Deputies, along with agents from the United States Marshal Service, arrested Belliston at a warehouse on Southwest 52nd Avenue near Alcala. He was booked into Marion County Jail on the following charges, shooting a missile into a vehicle, aggravated assault, criminal mischief, and displaying a firearm during a commission of a felony. Belliston remains jailed without bail. Man, what a crazy story. Um, I can't believe, you know, these two truck drivers got into it so bad to where they started shooting guns at each other while driving their tractor trailers on the freeway. But anyways, let me know what your thoughts are in the comments below. Do you feel that it's right for truck drivers to have firearms in their cab while driving? Should it be illegal? Uh, what would you do if this happened to you? But yeah, it's just crazy, and uh, thank God, um, according to the report, nobody was hurt or injured. And uh, the truck driver that fired back clearly fired out of self-defense. But um, yeah, I just wanted to put this video out because it's a crazy video, and uh, I just want to know what you guys' thoughts are. Um, in other news, uh, I just want to give a shout out to another YouTube channel that I follow, Trucking and Politics. And his channel focuses on pretty much politics and how it affects the trucking industry. The government is always changing rules and regulations towards the trucking industry. And for the most part, it makes it worse for us truck drivers, whether we're owner operators, company drivers, lease operators, um, from dry van to flatbed, container, tankers, oversized, heavy, or any sector of the trucking industry that you could think of. It seems like politicians just keep on regulating us truck drivers more and more. Um, but yeah. Trucking and Politics is a really good channel, so go ahead, check him out. He's growing. He 
He's a new channel and he has a lot of great informational content. So uh, go ahead, check him out, subscribe to him. And um, other than that, I just wanted to get this video out there, show this crazy story with you guys. And uh, that's pretty much it for now. Go ahead and like this video, subscribe, and share this video with somebody you know. All right, everyone. God bless you and your families. Stay safe, stay strong, and I'll see you on the next one. Ooh.